Welcome to Data Doctor's video, Suggestions 573 and 576, Find a Grave, Empty Birth and Death Date. Suggestion 573 is caused when a Wikitree profile with a matched link to a Find a Grave memorial has no birth date entered, but the memorial does. Suggestion 576 is caused when the death date is missing from the profile. Here is the suggestion report for Josiah Coe. There is only one suggestion, 576, empty death date. The info column shows the date missing from the profile, year 1846, no month, no day. Here is Josiah's public profile. There is no death date in the data section, even though the Find a Grave reference is listed in the Biography section under See Also. Click on the Find a Grave link to ensure it matches the Wikitree profile. Everything looks correct. Josiah's memorial has several headstone photos, including one of his death date. Let's see if we can find further documentation. Return to his profile and click the Root Search link on the right. Root Search offers several sites to choose from. Let's start with Family Search. Note, you have to be logged into that site first. On Family Search, add the Find a Grave Death Year and Place on the left to refine our search. Click Update. Except for the Find a Grave source, which is already on the profile, there is nothing else to indicate Josiah's date of death. However, there is a corroborating source for his date of death in a Sons of the American Revolution application. But it is on Ancestry, a paid site. For thoroughness, that record will be added to the profile for those who have access to that site. On Josiah's profile, click Edit. In the Data section, add the date of death and mark as certain. Add the place of death and mark as certain. Go to the Edit section and add his death information to the biography. Place your cursor at the end of that text and click on the citation button above. Between the ref tags, add the Sons of the American Revolution record noted earlier. Add the information about his burial site. As before, create an inline citation. Since the Find a Grave source under C also is just the URL, let's change it to the recommended format. Return to the Find a Grave Memorial and copy the source citation. On the profile, paste it between the ref tags. Add the Wikitree Find a Grave template and delete the first URL. Last, delete the original source under See Also. Click on Preview to check your work. Make sure that the inline citations are properly showing in the biography and sources sections. Go to the middle of the profile page and explain your changes. This is strongly recommended for all Wikitree users and is required for data doctors. For me, I identify myself as a data doctor, copy the suggested number and name, and explain what I changed. Save your work. Return to the Suggestions report and on the far right click on Status. On the Suggestion Status page, make sure your Wikitree ID is showing. Of the five status options, choose one, in this case, correct it. Leave a comment from the commentants or make one of your own. I left one of my own. Click the Update Status button. The last screen shows the status history has recorded your changes. And you're done.
please note that Suggestion 573 is resolved the same way, except that the date of birth is added. You are invited to like this video and even leave a comment if you wish. Also, keep up to date with new videos by subscribing to our Wikitree YouTube channel. On behalf of the Data Doctors Project, thank you for watching.